Hi, I'm Tim. Welcome to our channel. Thanks for logging on. Today, we're discussing the Glasuta original Senator 60s chronograph. 42 millimeters in stainless steel. You can see and you can purchase this mid-century inspired Glasuta original Senator automatic chronograph on our website. Subscribe to our YouTube channel if you enjoy these videos and please click on the card in the upper right hand corner of the screen at any time during this video to see our complete listing for this watch with additional high resolution images, accessories included, and naturally full pricing details. Now on my wrist, six and a third inches, 16 centimeters in circumference. This is a vintage inspired watch with contemporary size and scale. Now proportionally, it looks very much like it's 1960s forebear. However, the watch at 42 millimeters, not including crown or pushers, has a modern stance on the wrist. It's broad shouldered and surprisingly so. In terms of thickness, the watch is 12.5 millimeters thick, but it wears effectively thinner, and here's why. Take a look at that sloped bezel, and then look at that dramatically domed sapphire. The purpose of that sapphire is to emulate the look of mid-century plexiglass or acrylic crystals, and it does that, but it also provides the scratch resistance that you expect from a modern watch. Now, the sum total of all that sloped flank is that the watch, though 12.5 millimeters thick, wears almost like an ultra-thin in the way it slips underneath a tight sleeve or formal cuff. In terms of lug-to-lug -lug measurement, 48.5 millimeters is quite reasonable for a 42 millimeter diameter watch, and the lugs are exceptionally sweet. Not only do they thrust down sharply, a feature that I like to see on larger timepieces because it aids my 16 centimeter, 6.3 inch circumference wrist in proper fit, but here, not only do they taper down dramatically and wrap around the wrist, but they are very spare lugs beautifully compound curved. They're gorgeous, but they keep the focus on the case and the dial. They're about as minimal as lugs can get without disappearing entirely. Now the strap is a handsome round scale alligator leather. This is a treatment rarely seen as we more commonly see the larger square scales or rectangular scales. So aesthetically, this creates yet another vintage image as this type of alligator leather is universally associated with more of a vintage vibe than the larger, more modern rectangular scale. And on the bottom, beautifully finished, it's a supple calf skin. And this is the part that touches the wrist, so absolutely comfortable. It's paired with a very high quality and surprisingly elaborate pin style buckle with the Glasuda original logo inset. Now, as you can see, this one is exceptionally well kept by its owner. So though a pre-owned watch, we consider this to be a no compromise pre-owned timepiece in every respect. The contours of the case are handsome, in large part because it has a nice squat profile. It does look vintage and it has a beautifully double stepped bezel with conical profile leading into that domed sapphire. So the case is handsome and vintage inspired and it gives way to a dial that is the exact same. It has a nice 60s style bicompax chronograph arrangement whereby you have chronograph seconds at center, that's chronograph seconds hand. You have a chronograph minutes counter at nine o'clock and then constant seconds at three o'clock. It is a modular chronograph, so you get the advantage of a vertical clutch engagement. So you can simply leave the chronograph engaged if you prefer to have hours, minutes, and seconds constantly at the center of the dial. Now, vintage inspiration continues in the baton style hands, the lancet style of the chronograph seconds hand, the minimalist stick indices, and the highly stylized Arabic numerals 12 and 6 at their respective stations. Of course, the watch is overall very Teutonic in character, so it's definitely a tribute to an era, but it's a tribute to an era that is still very much rooted in the Saxon or East German tradition of watchmaking, aesthetically and in terms of spirit. The watch has a lot of character, but it accomplishes that in subtle fashion. It's a powerful timepiece dominated by a broad dial with a minimalist bezel. The watch jumps off the wrist with its potent combination of black dial, black strap, and gloss white metal. Extremely fetching. It's also extremely versatile as you can wear this watch casually, but at the same time, it's prepared to dress up all the way to the top. Suit, tie, tuxedo, it doesn't matter. On the case back, a most elaborate display. Now, you don't see what's going on at first glance when you look at it straight on like this. But when I start to turn it, you can see that the sapphire on the case back is as elaborate as the one on the front. Now this is the GUB caliber 39-31. It's a modular chronograph based on a Glasuda original caliber 39 with the Dubois de Praz vertical clutch chronograph module on the top. Now you can see the characteristic 
golden winding mass, skeletonized filigree style winding rotor. You can see the gorgeous linear glossuta stripes. Extremely handsome. You can see the impressive dressage across the reduction wheel of the winding system. It's a handsome movement and it's made all the more dramatic by the exquisite and unusual treatment of the sapphire above it. In fact, so dramatically is that sapphire cut that you can actually see horizontally the plane of the winding mass. You can actually see straight on the gold itself, which is unusual as we're typically given a vantage point over and above the winding system. This one puts you right on a plane with it, and again, it's more striking in person because when you see a watch with a full sapphire case back, not a window, more like a panorama, it really is striking and it really is distinctive. This is a watch that accomplishes that purpose on both sides. And of course, that caliber featuring a robust hacking function such that you can stop the balance and synchronize it precisely to a known accurate reference time. You'll note that is a high-grade chronometer style balance. Moreover, the movement itself an in-house Glossuda original produced entirely within the manufacturer features a 40-hour power reserve. It is modular, it does hack, it is 4 hertz, automatic, with ultra-efficient unidirectional winding. This watch is the complete technical and aesthetic package. You can see it and you can purchase it on our website.